North Korea is readying for war with military exercises set to take place as early as next month. The U.S. military said the Hermit Kingdom is currently preparing for war drills in December. It has warned the South that it must be fully ready for the worst. A South Korean military official said, currently, the North Korean troops are conducting ordinary field exercises. But our military is keeping a full readiness posture against the possibility of North Korea's provocations, he continued. These military drills come as Kim Jong-un warned that nuclear war may break out at any moment. He also slammed reckless moves of aggression from the U.S. Newspaper KCNA, Kim's media mouthpiece, launched a renewed threat of annihilation to the world in response to ongoing military exercises around the Korean Peninsula by America and South Korea. The media puppet said the joint marine drill around the Pekryong and Yonpyeong Islands aimed at a preemptive strike at major targets of North Korea was a deliberate and planned military provocation to further strain the situation of acute confrontation. The situation of the Korean Peninsula is now on the worst phase of tension in which a nuclear war may break out any moment due to the U.S. reckless moves for aggression on the DPRK. So, it is clear what a catastrophic phase such war games will bring, it continued. The puppet warmongers, keen on the moves to provoke a war, escalating the tension in collusion with outsiders, are harassers of peace and traitors to the nation who can never be allowed to go scot-free. The military provocation act of the puppet forces going helter-skelter with the backing of their master is a suicidal act of digging their own graves. The US President Donald Trump has been touring Asia, and he is conducting military drills in the Korean Peninsula. Three aircraft carriers, the USS Ronald Reagan, USS Theodore Roosevelt and USS Nimitz, were seen patrolling the North Korean coast. In a statement, the US military said the US Navy mobilized three aircraft carriers and 11 Aegis destroyers, while the Republic of Korea Navy mobilized seven warships including two Aegis destroyers.